Hey everybody, Fiasco back in Epcot. It's actually been a while since I've been back because of uh, my medical stuff, but I am back now and happy to be back. And the first thing that I'm gonna eat now that I'm back in Epcot is a item that I also haven't eaten in a while, and that's the fish and chips from the Yorkshire Fish Company uh, quick service booth here at uh, the UK Pavilion in Epcot. Very excited, I have it in front of me. It looks delicious. But before we dig in and I let you know how it is, let me remind you, all these videos are brought to you by Dreams Unlimited Travel. Our travel experts are standing by right now to help you plan that next vacation. All that info and more can be found in the description below. Let's eat. Okay, so I decided to join too. And I gotta say, the first thing I noticed right away is that this is tastier than the last time I had it because the fish itself, I feel like they gave us a lot more fish rather than batter because last time it was just like straight batter and there wasn't a lot of fish. But this time, it is a ton more fish. It is, I feel like it's also a little bit more fresh and you do need to salt it. That's what I gotta say. But yeah, overall, I really like this. I would get it again. So our fish and chips here, uh, 11.49. After tax, it was 12.29. And I will echo what Haley just said, because I believe I was there for the last time she had it too. And it was like all batter. This time it was not. However, that batter is like super thick and crispy. So we didn't, we, we got three forks. I uh, definitely grab a knife, definitely grab a knife. It's gonna save yourself a lot of trouble. Um, but I really do like this a lot. Uh, it definitely is just that simple fried food flavor uh, with nothing really extra. I, 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 we added salt and it definitely needed salt. Uh, Haley was dipping it in ketchup. Definitely could use ketchup too. I don't like ketchup. Um, for something like this, I would just, you know, grab like in a, um, in like a Irish pub or something. I would just ask for lemons and I'd squeeze a lemon over that. Yeah, they don't have lemons at the quick service stop. Um, maybe you could go on an adventure and ask Rose and Crown for a lemon. Maybe it'll give it to you. I don't know. I didn't try it, but I would like a lemon. But with that being said, um, I think it's quite good. You see how uh, crispy the breading is. Got this awesome scenery behind me, minus the barges. I haven't seen the fireworks show live yet. So I can't tell you if it was worth it to put those barges out there. The fries definitely come unsalted. And they definitely do need salt. It is also worth mentioning that uh, this is a mobile order location. Not all quick services in Epcot are. I think there's like five or six that are. Um, and this is one of them. This is one of those ones where you could like mobile order and pick a time in advance, like to come back later and get your food or, or now or soon. Um, but you don't have to do it. Just because it has that option, you don't have to do it. I did notice a couple people as I was in line waiting, walk up and get their mobile orders, which was obviously a lot quicker than waited in line, which is what I did. But um, both options are there, whatever you want. The line wasn't too bad. Waited like maybe five minutes tops. Um, and it was good. Didn't blow my mind. Could use more flavor, could use lemons, but it was pretty good. Uh, but that is gonna do it for this quick little dining video. I uh, hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one.